It's become such a problem at a Pflugerville Elementary School that the principal there sent a letter home telling parents she thinks they don't know what time school begins. KXAN's Tom Miller explains why this is happening and what's being done about it. It's rush hour outside Pflugerville's Windermere Elementary School as parents race in and out of the parking lot getting their kids into class. Problem is, school's already started. We were actually running late this morning. Denise Vega is among the parents who admit you're going to drop the ball every once in a while juggling so many responsibilities. With three kids, two dogs, and a hedgehog, it's a little challenging sometimes to get us all ready. However, the problem is such an issue, the school's principal sent this letter to parents saying, we have an abnormally high amount of tardies now in our fourth full week of school. All of you are arriving by 745, which makes me think that you may have missed the change in start time this school year. So what's changed here? Namely, the school start time. It's up this year by 10 minutes, just enough time to throw people off. We started a new bell schedule this year. Um, we let everybody know over the summer. As for the impact in the classroom, teacher Kathy Warren says late arrivals slow you down. They have to readdress to that one student. It kind of throws off the flow. You know, if mommy is late for work, I'll get in trouble. Um, so really trying to just model that, you know, behavior as well. Working to improve attendance and get students started in the right direction. In Pflugerville, Tom Miller, KXAN News. According to the Texas Education Agency, tardies do not impact school funding, but Texas schools are allowed to take their own disciplinary action against students who show up late to class.